time for me to re-review Deadblock, this time with a microphone. Now this is one of my favorite games from the PlayStation 3. Even though it was a multi-platform game, I still played it predominantly on the PlayStation 3 with my little sister back in the day. As for the PC port, it's pretty good. The con is, there is no DLC levels. They did not include the DLC. And it still does not feature online co-op. Though it can still be played locally via split screen with another player. Now what is Deadblock? Essentially, it's a tower defense style zombie game. Where you get to play as Jack, a construction worker. Mike, a boy scout. And Foxy, a security guard. Or I think she's supposed to be a cop. Each one coming with their own abilities, and each one moving a certain amount of speed and doing a certain amount of damage to the enemy. And each of their abilities can be utilized to help you survive each level. For example, Jack has a nail gun, which will temporarily keep the zombies in place so you can attack them. When it upgrades later on, it turns into a freeze gun and every zombie hits now freezes solid and can be destroyed instantly. Mike, he gets a burger which temporarily distracts the zombies so you can attack them or run away. When it upgrades it turns into a time bomb which explodes over a certain amount of time and also still distracts the zombies. Foxy she gets a handgun which can kill all zombies in the room but only a small amount and his upgraded gun her upgraded gun is a shotgun which can kill more the game is simple your goal is to kill the zombies destroy objects gather resources build tower defense traps in the doorways and windows and then gather the equipment needed to play the guitar and rock the dead back to the dead as the zombies get destroyed from the rock and roll which in turn originally created them apparently the game is simple charming and a whole lot of fun Whichever platform you can try to play it on, it's enjoyable. The game was originally released in 2011 for the PS3 and 360 before coming to Windows in 2012. And pretty much the only place you can originally buy it was Amazon, I think. The game is developed in Unreal Engine 3 and it was originally made by Candy Gun Games and published by Digital Reality. Overall, the game is pretty much pretty good. I wholeheartedly recommend it with an easy thumbs up on the recommendation and four stars out of five for great. That's all. See ya.